Yeah, the old lay on the couch with the TV on. Ah, uh, uh, filming live from a third-story one-bedroom apartment in North Mishawak, Indiana, the Princess City, cursed by geese. It's the Handlebar Growing Mustache Extravaganza with your host Dave. Handlebar Mustache Show, Handlebar Mustache Show. Stash is looking great, but we can't be late for the Handlebar Mustache Show. Ah, uh, click here. Let's see. Welcome back to Year Six, Day Fifty-One. Take two overtime edition. Well, we've been watching the Celtics and the Boston Washington play. Uh, pretty good game so far. Ah, Fat, is that you? Oh, yeah, Clint, I can't believe it. And then I got to explain I got a necklace from the Voodoo Museum. It's part of the Grizz Grizz, which is the. Physical manifestations of the voodoo is the Grizz Grizz. And this is for joy and... What did I say? F wisdom. Joy and wisdom. So I figure since I got both of those, I can double down and get even better. What do you think about that, Fat? Sounds pretty good. So I can use all the help I can get. That's the way I see it, anyway. Yeah. So, it looks like this game could be over. Six points with a minute left. Ah, uh, it's never over. That minute uh, will last for that. 20 minutes. Oh, we can't say that. Mm -mm. So, anyway, I got that going for me. Um... I get to give a speech on Friday in Elkhart. I can't wait for that. I gave her the rough copy email, and then I called her by mistake. I said, is it too late? She goes, oh, no. She, those young kids don't sleep as much as the old kids do. So I got that going for me. Were you making eggs and ham and cheese? I made them already. I didn't make one. Oh. Maybe I'll make you some eggs tomorrow, Fran, if I can wake up. <laughs> you just got to push out my belly. Say, listen, you big flunk. Time to get up and make me some breakfast. Right, Fran? I can try. Oh, yeah. And you just growl, and I just say, oh, the hell with it. Oh, you can't say that, Fran. That's my natural response to waking up at before time. I'm like a big bear, a big angry bear. But if I can make you eggs, I can make me eggs. I'd have to wipe out the pan, though. I gotta re uh, just the what's we call it the cast iron too. So you're supposed to use lard, I heard. For what? For cast iron to season it to begin with. Oh, I mean I don't know. I guess vegetable oil could work too, but you mean from the beginning? Yeah, probably lard, probably the best. But I mean, really. Where I mean, any any um, I think anything that's a solid at room temperature would be better. Then yeah, but it's still just so Crisco would work. Hard, but it's not really large. That reminds me of a joke, which I can't tell on this show. There'll be another oh. show of bad jokes. We'll save that for the the show when this one bombs out, and we've got to. Think for something deep. Oh, yeah, when all the advertisers leave me <laughs> and I don't make my nine cents a month. <laughs> when you're an angry old handlebar mustache guy and you're just going off in the world, no, we can't have that. No. All right. Well, I've probably said too much. I think I have. All right. In that case, knock on wood, keep it classy in the web, and until I see you manana. From Fat T and I, we all bid you arrivederci and adieu. 
Oh, that was nice. That was nice. Oh, it's going to be a good one in your town tonight.